Hi, I'm Wes. Let's talk about Force Bar's Marlon Vented Loops. Vented Loops play a very important part in your marine plumbing. They keep the water from siphoning back into your boat through a bilge pump or an engine aqua lift system, it's commonly known as a water jacketed exhaust. Also keeps the wastewater system from siphoning back through your head after you finish pumping. They're all too often neglected and forgotten. If the exit through hull for your bilge pump is at or below the water line, you must have a vented loop installed in that line. You should also have a seacock on the through hull to comply with ABYC standards. The vented loop stops the potential of siphoning water back into the boat after the bilge pump shuts off. The same is true of the aqualift system in your exhaust. The head systems they keep, well, let's just say a real disaster from happening. All vented loops work in basically the same way. They break a siphon by allowing air to enter the line at the topmost position in the plumbing line. They do use different valve designs, however. Well, the Marlon vented loops use a one-way duckbill style valve, the same they use in the medical field. Very reliable, and like any anti-siphon though, they require routine inspection and maintenance to ensure proper function. First of all, they must be kept clean. Salt buildup or debris can cause them to stay open and allow a squirt of whatever fluid is flowing through them to come out. To clean them, rinse them with clean water, or if they're in your waistline, use a little bit of white vinegar. Just be sure that they're closing by carefully looking at the duck on the bottom. If you see a deformed bill or a large buildup of waste deposits, replace the cap assembly. When reinstalling, be sure you don't over tighten the cap and force the unit to deform. Hand snug is all it really needs. Force Bar makes Marlon vented loops in more sizes than anyone in the industry. We offer half inch, five eighths, three quarter, one inch, one and an eighth, and one and a half. They all use the same size, reliable, one way duckbill valve on top. Remember that a vented loop must have fluid pushed through them. If you try and pull or suck water through them, you'll, not, you'll get air and not fluid. The air is much lighter than water. The fluid being pushed through the loop causes the one-way valve to close. If there's any vacuum, the valve opens to allow air to enter and stops, that anti it stops the siphoning from forming. Remember also mount the vented loop as high above the water line as possible. This is especially true on sailboats because heeling over on long tacks. For more information and diagrams as well, go to forcebar.com. Thank you.